Next on tonight's show, we have the VW Boys along with Clarence Tater Tate. Now, when Tater Tate heard Lester Flatt and Earl Scruggs cut loose on Train 45 on WCYB out of Bristol, he said, that sound just sent cold chills up my spine. Well, that prompted the mandolin guitar player to pick up the fiddle and bow. Tater went on to work with Bill Monroe's Bluegrass Boys for more years than anyone else, and he was Lester Flatt's last fiddle player. He's performed on over 60 albums with various artists and was a regular on the Grand Ole Opry. Tonight, he performs with a trio of characters who blend music, magic, and comedy to present a complete variety show. Their performance credits range from Dollywood and Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, to openings for comedic late greats such as Jerry Clower and Don Knotts. I'm sure you'll recognize one of the VW boys, but don't hold that against the others. But this life ain't worth living I can't 